Countdown to Kindergarten. Hi, good evening, everyone. This is Lori Brewer. I'm so glad to see, well, to be with you all. All right, we're going to be reading a new story tonight, and it's been a while, and so glad we're back together. All right. Amen. Hope all is well with y'all, and、uh, much love and prayers to each and every one of you. So let's begin. This is we got some, a story. It's about we're all going back to school, so this seemed appropriate.、It、says countdown to kindergarten. It's by Allison McGee, and pictures by Harry Bliss. Thank you, Lord. Look, she's getting out of bed, and she says, "I am in big trouble." Oh. I'm going to kindergarten in ten days. I've heard it from a first grader that they have a lot of rules there. Rule number three: you're not allowed to bring any stuffed animals. Hand over the stuffy. You know the rules. Rule number two: you're not allowed to bring your cat. Dear kitty, I miss you. Rule number one: you have to know how to tie your shoes by yourself. You're not allowed to ask for help, ever. Anyone, you cannot ask anyone to tie your shoes. Want to know what I can do? Count backwards from ten. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Want to know what I can't do? Tie my shoes. Nine days before kindergarten. This isn't getting any easier. Later, I know I'll hide my shoes. Mom finds everything. She even found the needle in the haystack. Eight days before kindergarten. Oh, yuck! Even the muddy. Rain is getting out. Is even the rain puddle is out to get me. I know. I'll pull the laces out. Imagine what could happen if I left them in. Oh no! It's our fault, Doctor. We made her wear those awful shoelaces. We should have listened. I know. I'll throw them out. Look, your mother has found these in the trash. Don't they belong to you? I guess she's got quite the imagination, doesn't she? Seven days before kindergarten, Dad says five-year-olds don't know how how to tie. I guess he hasn't heard kindergarten number rule number one: you can't ask for help ever. So look, her dad is practicing with her. See, bunny ears, bunny ears, cross through. Look at his knot, just the way he shows me. <laughs> Six days before kindergarten. What should I try now, poor Puddy? You look so hungry. Puddy, here's your lunch. Look, she's putting where she put in the Puddy Cat's food. Look what happens later that day. Dad says, "Repeat after me: Bowls are for cats, cat food. Shoes are for your feet." <laughs> That's so cute. Five days before kindergarten, Mom says there are a lot of five-year-olds that don't know how to tie. <laughs> I guess she doesn't know <laughs> rule number one either. Once again, you can't ask for help. Never ever. I wonder if she, if you show up for kindergarten wearing baby shoes. I'm sorry. Baby shoe wearers have to take rest time in the sub basement. Good luck. So here she's trying loop, pull around, and pull. No. <laughs> oh, she's、oh、trying、God. so hard. Psst. Four days before Christmas. She's 
just waking up a pretty cat. I mean, before kindergarten? Yes, before kindergarten, <laughs> four days before. What bones? What will I ever do? Poor Duffy is so sad. You said four days before Christmas. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he still doesn't know how to tie either. Maybe a ride in a canoe would cheer him up. Cheerful! Careful, Mr. Ducky, don't you know? You should never stand up in a canoe. Here's her dad, repeat after me. Shoes are not canoes. <gasps> Three days before kindergarten. Lou, pull around, poke and pull. Dad is so nice, he even bought me new shoelaces. That should help. <gasps> Snack time for pudding. Oh my goodness. Later that day, I know, I know. Repeat after me. Shoelaces are not food. It's so funny. Two days before kindergarten. Look, pretty cat has his mufflers over his ears. She looks, oh, she's getting desperate now. My parents are taking me out for my favorite dinner, spaghetti. To celebrate the start of school. I don't see anything to celebrate. How's your bowl of shoelaces? I mean spaghetti. <laughs> oh, Dad says, don't worry, sweetie. It takes time. But kindergarten starts in two days. What if I have to wear a sign that says Velcro, girl? Ooh, Velcro. One day before kindergarten. What if they don't have let me have playground time and no one gets to see me jump rope, counting backwards from 10? What if they don't let me have snack or I miss the last bell and get locked in school all night without you, Puddy? And I miss my dinner and my dessert and my bedtime story and my goodnight kiss? I'm doomed! <laughs> You'll be all right. Aw, she has a friend. Yes, yeah, like us, we have a friend in Jesus. Amen. Look, first day of <laughs> kindergarten. <laughs> Look at all those feet. All those bows. Look, Dad's waving by. Mom, she's crying. Oh, my baby. Later that morning. Really? Your dad tied your shoes for you, too? Me too. You guys can't tie your shoes either? Look, she's not alone. You are you only know three kindergartners who can tie their shoes? Three, two, one? That's all? I thought I was the only one. Look here. Look, these are the rules for kindergarten. Monday, shoe time. Teacher can help. Aw. Tuesday, look, she gets to bring a stuffed animal. Wednesday, counting backward from 10. I guess I'm not in such big trouble after all. That's the end. So you see, the first day of kindergarten is really Something very special for each and every one of us. We had, she got to what? What did she learn? She got to ask for help from her teacher. Yes, she was not the only one that did not know how to tie her shoe. She got to bring her stuffed animal and count backward from 10. So I hope you all have a wonderful first day at kindergarten. And you all just be blessed and share your day with others, all right? All right, and much love to you all, all right? This is Miss Brewer. I love you all, and see you all soon. Mwah. A special thanks to Lori Brewer for the reading. God bless you.